Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Vincent Schwenk and in this quick tutorial I want to talk about how to create this ribbon around my um, concrete cylinders. If you like the whole frame of the whole artwork, that's something I will talk about in my Patreon channel. But today is gonna be about the ribbons and this is mostly quite a quick tutorial. So let's directly dive into cinema. I'm using here R22 and I will just create like three cylinders and I'm rotating them. So one, two, three and I'm just placing them like close together. So that's number two and number three goes a bit up. Nice. So then overall I want to have a bit more segments. So in my if I'm pressing NB, you can see the lines and everything is smooth and round. And these are my concrete cylinders. This is the first part. And the second part is also quite easy. We need another cylinder, but this time without a cap. And the height can be also a bit smaller. And I'm creating a cylinder which is quite big, which goes over all the objects because I want to use soft body to shrink it down and this object should also have a few more segments but not too many because it's soft bodies and let's group these ones and they are concrete and they should get a collider tag so I'll go into simulation tag select collider tag and this is my class. And this guy is gonna get a soft body tag. Perfect. Then if I press Ctrl D, you can see your overall project settings and I don't have gravity in here. Normally you have 1000 there, but I'll put it down to zero because I only want to concentrate on the simulation. Then I click onto the soft body and into the soft body tabs, I want to change some values. Well, first of all, I want to put out some of the dampening so it gets flexed quicker and this flexion and shear can be shrinked down and also structural um, should drop by 50%. So I'm having 50 and 10, 10, 10, 10 and then the most important value is the rest length. Like roughly I want this ribbon to be half of its size. So then in general I'm giving it a quick save because it's soft bodies ribbon so i'm going back to frame zero and press play and this looks already quite nice so because soft bodies are quite leggy and well they crush sometimes so but overall this ribbon is still a bit too um, thick so let's shrink the radius down to 30 uh, the height down to 30 and perhaps also everything can shrink down a little bit more, so 45%. And yeah, this is too much shrinking, I would say 50 is fine. So animation, there are some problems in here. And we will try to fix that by increasing our segments. And also perhaps the stuff body shouldn't stretch too much so 55 is perhaps a good value so the ribbon should be a bit smaller overall and i like the simulation of this guy so i'm copying him also three times and i'm placing them onto my art onto my um, canvas here now let's press play for all of them and yeah that is quite nicely so I would say I give myself like 50 frames and I want by the way if you're also having the same bug if you go back to frame zero and nothing happens you have to go one frame forward and a frame backward to fix that and again I want some variation so I would say this guy's 10 and this guy 20 in the height so they all have a different size and now I'm caching everything, so I'm just selecting one tag and go to cache and bake all. And 
then we scrub down to the frame which you like, for example 45. And now I can just delete my tags. No, I can't, because first of all I have to convert my class object and now again I have to bake it. But if the object is converted and you bake it, you can delete the tag itself and you have your ready object. And because I don't, I don't care about animation in this artwork, I only want a still. So now everything is fixed and I can continue to manipulate the guy. So, and as a last thing, what I will do, I will search for my cloth surface and in so cloth surface and in the cloth surface I don't want the subdivisions I will do that later on in the uh, renderer for example Red of Dark Octane you can subdivide it so it can stay here quick and fast I just want a little bit of depth so 0.25 in thickness I would say this is something we want and yeah that's the final piece and that's how I created the ribbons in here so I hope you liked this mini tutorial and if you want to see more you can have a look at my Patreon and see the whole video for this tutorial. So thank you very much for watching and bye bye.